Outdoor dining at restaurants reopens today in Ohio. It's one of the topics that Local 12's David Winter is covering now in the Breaking News Center. David, good afternoon to you. Good afternoon, Liz. It's been exactly two months since the governor shut down restaurants and so many other businesses around the state. It was just one of the things that was discussed today at the Hamilton County Commission Chambers. Uh, let's first take a look at the numbers that they also discussed today. In Hamilton County, there are currently 1,927 cases of coronavirus. That's only an additional 70 since Monday. There are 355 people hospitalized from COVID-19. That's only 22 more since Monday. And there have been 105 deaths since this pandemic began in this county. Four people have died this week. While increases are not good, when you look at the progression of the numbers, things are so much better than they have been. This is a graphic that the county showed this morning. It shows the obvious peak about three and a half weeks ago and then a steady decline in the rate of new cases in blue, hospitalizations in yellow and deaths in red. The interim health commissioner wants to make sure this trend holds. So as businesses reopen, he asks that people report non-compliance to safety rules. Our process is a uh, phone call to the store first. Secondly, if we continue to get complaints, we will go to the store and do an inspection. And then if necessary, we'll issue a notice of violation. Hamilton County will begin taking grant applications next week for companies with lost revenue due to the pandemic. The county will distribute tens of millions of dollars to businesses via lottery. Uh, this is for nonprofit or excuse me, this is for for profit businesses. There will be nonprofit grants in the future. Businesses must have been in operation since 2019 with a physical storefront and less than $1 million in gross revenue. They must have experienced a decrease in revenue related to COVID-19 of 35%, and they must not have already received the PPP loan from the feds. There will be two buckets of money, one for businesses with 2 to 10 employees and the other with 11 to 50 employees. The application period will open and then it will close. And we will then have those businesses, we're going to sort them, 2 to 10, 11 to 50, and see how many we get in each pot that will determine the amount of money going to either very small or small to medium sized businesses. Those applications will be again available next week on Hamilton County's website. If you do go out and enjoy a restaurant this afternoon, which sounds like a great idea, your server will be required to wear a mask and it is highly suggested that you do as well, unless of course you're eating. Liz, back to you. We'll be a little tough. Thank you, Dave.